guys, uh, you're back. So soon, huh? Yeah, you want another review? You want another... Whatever you want. Just tell me what you want me to do in the comments below. So, review this. What should we review today? Is it this? Oh, yes. So. So, my... So, today we're going to be reviewing the stockades. Uh, yeah, let's, let's call it the stockade. Is this the right review again? No, it's not. You yeah. already did one. Oh. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Bad memory, bad memory. So, Alpha Trooper. So, Alpha Trooper C6. Is this, no, is this the correct one? You did that already a, a, a long time ago. Okay, okay, okay. Probably a year. Okay, uh, how about... Okay, this gun. Carry on. I don't think you've done that before. So, we'll do this. Alright. So... Centurion, uh, uh, also known as Mega Centurion, is the first mega gun to be branded Mega, but it's not the first gun to ever shoot Mega. There's vintage Nerf guns used to have the same dark as this, so yeah, it's just a good color. So, Mega Centurion. So, it comes with a six round mag with well, six magnets. has this really long charging handle, aka bolt. Pull this much and push it back. Good. And there's actually two indicators. One for three actually. One for the jam door. Oh wait, two, sorry. Damn it. <clears throat> I'm really sorry guys, my memory's just, just not going well today. So two. One for the jam door. If you push it there, zoom in please. Yeah, I'm zooming in. You see here it's there's it's just orange, but if you push in, there's green. And there's also a, a one right here. Zoom in, please. It's zoomed in. And you see when I from it back, it's green. See when I push it forward, I think. It has two tactical rails. One which has a comes with a bipod. I, I forgot where I put the bipod. So sorry. Uh, and one for attaching scopes, like for example. This. Well, Nerf guns can actually aim, but come on, you have the 50 cal sniper, you can aim down here. So, yeah, so, Mega Centurion, let's see. Also has backup iron sights. Uh, the, the back post is over here. Oh, we're gonna go in the 80s now. And then we have one over here, so. I got this really weird hand guard. I don't know what you call it. Like hand rest, whatever. It's really uncomfortable if you really have big hands. You're gonna have to fit your whole thing in here. And we have two this, this gun too much. One, two, three, four sling sling mounts. Oh five. One thing. The size of this gun oh, yeah, the is size. extreme. Here, it's almost. It's probably nearly as tall as me. I don't know. It's it's like the size of my hips, maybe. Is it Maria? I think. Firing range. Okay, right. right, so we, <coughs> we are going to set up uh, another firing range with these. These are actually empty canisters, but they can take a hit from a Mega Centurion. So let's go to the firing range. We're going to have two targets, okay? Okay. So we're going to try to hit the target here, so... That target. So he's trying World War II style now. Indeed. Indeed. The Springfield sucks and Call of Duty zombies at least. That's because it's true. Talk 
the Germany. Rick Coffin. He's German. Floor target. Uh, no chair target. Okay. You just took it out. Oh my god! <laughs> Should I stop it now? No, so, so basically, basically, you want to take a centurion, don't snipe. That's what you should do. Melee. What are you doing? So guys, that wraps it up for today's video and 